Every night I hope and pray A dream lover will come my way A girl to hold in my arms And know the magic of her Hi, I'm Roberta Moore. Just want to wish all the vinyl collectors around the world who loves record just like me a happy National Vinyl Record Day 2021. Just keep collecting, keeping the vinyl alive. Just keep on doing what you're doing. Hope you enjoy it as much as I do. Happy National Vinyl Day. And for me, vinyl is final. Vinyl, that's where the music began. And no matter how long, no matter how many changes we go through, from A track to cassette to CD, vinyl still stands strong. Fantastic Four from back in the day. Most people are familiar with mixed up moods and attitudes. Yeah, well, this is the same group all the way back in the 60s. That's a big song, by the way. Yeah, mixed up moods. Yeah, man. First of all, the fidelity that you get from vinyl. You can't get that. You can't get that with, with digital, you know. So, for me personally, it's just to actually feel that in your hand. Yeah, it's, it's, it's almost like... It's almost like you're caressing somebody that you love. My whole music career started with vinyl. 1967, when I bought my first vinyl record with my lunch money. Vinyl gives you the story about the music, the writer, the producer, the arranger. I like the feel of putting the vinyl on the turntable and just seeing it spin and come to the end. And I've got to a stage where I know the songs inside out. From high school, from high school. Uh, so we're talking like early 80s. So we're talking about almost five years of vinyl. Yes, you know, so. My second year in high school, I bought my first record. It was an album by Nat King Cole, Nat King Cole's Greatest Hits. Um, because my aunt, who I live with, loved Nat King Cole. So I shared it with her. And I've been buying records ever since. So we're talking about 54 years of buying records. I started playing at parties on the 26th of December, 1970. I played at my first party. And that's, uh, what is that, 51 years. Yes, that's how long I've been playing vinyl. Find a vinyl group, you have many vinyl groups around the world. Join a group and just start to listen to some of these groups. Yeah, you yeah, find I'm in many vinyl groups around the world. So, you know, if they're really interested, they'll know where to find it. You know, it would be very hard to start collecting and playing vinyl at this point in time because record stores don't exist anymore, basically, at least here in Jamaica. Uh, you'd have to go on the internet and mainly places like Europe, Japan, to find records, even Jamaican records. Those are the places you'd have to go to find the records. And they're so expensive now. When I started buying records, they were cents. Some of those records now have become collector's items going for $500, $300. I don't think anyone getting into vinyl probably can afford to be a collector based on the price of records today. So it's going to be very difficult. But if you have a lot of money, 
the internet. I really reckon for me, like for a lot of other people, persons, you know, is um, you have records out there that it's only a few copies were ever made, you know, 50, 100, you know, maybe even less than that. So that automatically becomes a very rare record, you know. A hundred copies of a record, that's going to be a rare record. A hundred might sound like a lot, but you know, because, you know, even a thousand is, is rare. A rare record is a record that never really made the charts, but has a distinctive sound quality and uh, is very hard to find now. You can't find it that easily. They have never been reproduced or issued, reissued. And... Uh, they're just very hard to find. A lot of these records go for big money in the US, big bucks, even in Jamaica. Jamaican music have, have a lot of rare records that are very hard to find and go for big money. So a rare record is a record that is basically a good record that is loved by collectors that is hard to find. Happy National Vinyl Record Day. A happy National Vinyl Day. A dream lover will come my way.